Congratulations on your purchase of the NeckEase home decompression device. You are one step closer to improved spine health and decreased pain. In this instructional video, I'm going to show you the safest and most effective way to use this wonderful tool. NeckEase is increasingly effective with improved technique. So come back to this video several times if you need to. The first thing you want to do is find a space where you can lay down on the floor in front of a door that closes by pulling it toward you. It is very important to secure your neck ease in a door that you close by pulling towards you so that as you increase tension on the cord, it only becomes more secure. In fact, the terms of purchase you agreed to when buying neck ease require securing it to a door that closes towards you instead of away. If you anchor your neck ease in a door that closes away from you, the door could be pulled open and it could force the cord out of the door jam, potentially causing injury and interrupting traction. It is ideal to lay on a yoga mat or some other grippy surface so that your body is less likely to be shifted towards the door as you pull traction force. I also recommend wearing athletic shoes with a rubber sole for better grip and control when your foot, uh, feet are in the foot loops and you're applying pressure with your feet. Okay, let's get started with a session of decompression. So you're gonna take neck ease and open up the head strap. Position the device on your head with the shark skin neoprene at the back of your skull. And you're gonna close down the head strap, not too tight, but just snug enough to get started. We're gonna tighten it up later. The next thing you wanna do is take the red paracord or colored paracord part, and you're going to secure it in the door about six to 12 inches off the ground so that you get about a 20 to 40 degree angle when you're laying down. Carefully place the black pull tab and knot of the colored paracord behind the door jam and check that the door is securely closed. Now that you've made sure the door is nice and closed securely, you're gonna lay down on the floor. Sorry, you're gonna sit down on the floor and take the foot loops and put them on your feet. A little pro tip is to grab a couple sturdy rubber bands to place on the foot loops as you see here. Then, roll the band down to secure the loop at the ball of your foot so it doesn't slide out of place. Lay down and get yourself positioned so that the tensioning cable is in line above your nose. Then, just position yourself down and slide down, but make sure you have about a 30 to 40 degree bend in your knees when you get into position. Now here's where you're going to secure the head strap really tight. Reach up, feed the Velcro into the loop, and pull very hard on the head strap, then lay it back down. If it's pinching your ears, that's okay. Make sure they're positioned correctly, but you want this extremely tight, almost uncomfortably so. For the best positioning to generate good traction force through the tension cord, you want about a 30 to 45 degree bend at the knees with the cord taut. I bring my feet up a bit so I can wiggle my body down a little more. Next, I walk my heels back down a bit so I can press firmly with the balls of my feet, which creates pulling force at the neck. To decrease traction force, I pull up with my toes, which lowers tension in the cord. You do not want to simply press at the feet and hold constant traction force. The big advantage of neck ease over most other products is that you can perform intermittent traction which research has proven to provide the most therapeutic results. For the majority of painful conditions, protocols call for intervals of 10 to 30 seconds of traction force, followed by 7 to 10 seconds of rest, then repeat. Prolong the life of your neck ease by lining up the hook and loop Velcro on the head strap so it doesn't fray the other components. Roll up as shown and keep it stored in the included stuff sack until it's time for another pain relieving session of neck decompression. I'd like to thank Premier Spine and Pain Institute in Thornton and in Arvada, Colorado for helping to make this video possible. Premier Spine and Pain offers a compilation of services from minimally invasive injections and spine procedures to dry needling and chiropractic care. Whether you've been hurt on the job, an auto accident, or have chronic pain, Premier Spine has a solution for you. Please go to PSPI.com or click the link in the description below.